Every Phantom is going to be a little bit toxic, and to be honest with you, My Hero Academia has received the forefront of a lot of opinions and criticism because, for one, it's a popular series. Of course, there's going to be a few bad apples, and two, it's a popular series, so there's going to be some fucking stupid people making dumb fucking stupid shit. I'm not the first person to cover this, not by a long shot, but to be honest with you, I just needed a video today, and I was just going around Google and just seeing what, what, what I could be Googling, Googling away here, and just making another video on how uh, My Hero Academia uh, is a toxic piece of fandom, you know, in 2021, because, you know, if anyone's gonna just make terrible shit, it's gonna be them. Now, Shonen has its fair share of toxic people with all the death threats, all this. Naruto had it, Bleach had it. Not as much since it was a little bit older, but every series is going to just have terrible, terrible fans. But one of the things that r slash whooshed me because I was, I just didn't pay attention because, you know, toxic fandoms come and they go and, you know, it is what it is, is, is the Aryan overhaul ship, which... Ships in general, I think, are, like, they can be cutesy, you can have cute couples, and if you want to do, like, boy and boy, girl and girl, boy and girl, it's whatever, because a lot of shipping stuff is just sort of in good fun, and I still believe a lot of people are like, well, I like this couple, and I like this couple. Except, you know, for the people that were shipping Nenji and Hinata, like, a decade ago, because you know who you are, you terrible terrible people they're cousins i don't know maybe you're from alabama i don't i don't know what you're into dude maybe you fuck your dog I, hey here's the thing you're into what you're into and sometimes you're into your cousin or sometimes you want your cousin into you so before we get into stuff that you probably already know about so before we move forward into like describing how people are really dumb when it comes to toxic ships let's just make something clear every community is gonna have bashing no matter, I don't agree with it, I don't agree with bullying, I don't agree with death threats. Gotten a few with the channel doing what the channel does. It, like, I don't agree with anything when it comes to like threatening or trying to cause direct harm to another individual. But My Hero Academia has such a loud, and I, I hopefully minority, but the loud minority, you know, still makes waves here and there. I like My Hero Academia, I've liked the manga, I like the anime, I love all of it. And to be honest with you, even the few people I've interacted with the community that are way into it more than I am, again, you're going to have those people with any shonen anime or any anime in general. It's actually been a very good time. But man, when it comes to just how dumb a lot of this community is, and I think that like a lot of that can stem from the fact that maybe this is their first major anime they're getting into, maybe they're a little bit younger, maybe they don't really know what they're saying because, you know, being raised on the internet and poor parental anything yeah you're probably gonna make some terrible opinions say some terrible things and you know probably should get slapped every once in a while just saying just saying i'm bringing that out there just bringing that out there every community has bad people i'm just clowning on some people with some terrible opinions but you know the focus of this video is i'm gonna look at the area and the overhaul ship because you know well, there's nothing more romantic than trying to get with the guy or wanting the girl that the dude abused to get with him because you know on top of that it's a little it's a little it's 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 a pedal thing it's why are you this is gonna get gross like what is what like what are some of these what are some of these images when it comes to this like is it is it a, is abuse adorable like is being is being like oh my god you kidnapped me and tortured me oh and then like i just i just want them to be together because oh my god i don't even understand where a lot of any of this like stems from it was just a gross and just such a disgusting relationship and people like to romanticize shit but i mean there was a very clear point of hey man don't abuse kids and this is just like one of the most weird toxic ships that I, I just, I, it just baffles me of like how deluded people can be because wow, this is terrible. Again, a lot of shipping stuff can be very just cutesy and stuff, you know, people are like, well, I like this couple, I like this couple, no, I like this couple. And it's very rare, at least in my experience, that shipping in it, in it of itself is toxic. People are going to have disagreements about shit, it is what it is. A ship like this is just the dumbest, gross piece, of, like this is just garbage like through and through yeah i don't i don't understand the mindset of certain people i i just it's that's a, that's something that's just i i nah 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 and when it comes to other things of like my hero academia being fucking absolutely toxic in 2021 there's a, there's a weird there, there, like again like the death threats are are something that is probably going to come with like every series even though it's so despicable they just don't do that. Just, just, just be decent. And I can't imagine a lot of those death threats coming coming from people that are, you know, 
well adjusted and sometimes when people get a little bit too into things it gets you start taking things personally that you're not supposed to be taking personally and that that's sometimes you just gotta go for a walk guys and if you know if you're one of those toxic people like you know watching this video watching me clown on some my hero academia shit stop well i mean that uh, i just i just needed a i just needed a video guys so this was just me sort of shitting on my hero academia i don't think the majority of the fandom is toxic i think it like it might be like a third or a quarter which sure that's a lot of people but i don't think it's the majority i think it's the silent minority i made a couple jokes you know don't don't do don't do the things that you shouldn't do i'm excited for season five you know i'm, I'm just guys let's just let's just all let's all let's all be adults here or like you know reasonable people let's not make death threats and like let's not be stupid unless it's in cod because anything goes in cod lobbies well my name is raymond noodles that's the video for you today you know season five is coming out soon it's gonna be a good time if you like the video all that gross stuff but even more important than that reach out to somebody a friend or family member call or a text you never know what kind of day someone's having a call or a text for someone you like can make their day better except if you're toxic my hero academia fan anyway my name is raymond noodle i'll see you guys in the next one peace